Looks like we'll be playing border today. This is one of my favorite ranked maps, I think. It's usually pretty fun to play. There's kind of the default things you do, like the main breach, and there's also a lot of rat things you can really do on this one. I like it for solo queuing, though. It feels nice to play. I'm going to go and ban Jackal, like always. Team's voting for nothing. Okay, nice. I think somebody else voted Jackal. The other team banned Thatcher, as usual. They'll be on defense first. Yeah, they'll be on defense first. And my brain twisted up there. Let's see if they'll ban Mira or Valkyrie. Yep, there's the Mira. These are as default bands as you can possibly get. But I like that. No weird like cab bands or cap can or something like that. I'm just going to take the Ash for now and see. I might end up switching to a Bana though. I've been liking going to like the backside by Archives and getting that wall with a Bana from outside. You can do it from the east balcony. That's a very underrated strat to do. By doing it with a Bana too, I can open up an entire line of sight into the bomb sites. It goes all the way back to the end of Armory. It's crazy. You can see pretty much the half wall from there. All you have to do is make sure east is clear so you don't get shot through the barricade on these stairs. And then you pretty much have it, and you also have the site right there, the archives door, which defenders usually can't play if you have a teammate on the window. I'll show you guys here. I'll see if the team needs any help first. I might even take grenades. Our teammate just got off Nook. I think I'm going to take her. Hopefully they can get a plant down. Spawning Valley. I'm not sure if they're going for the main breach or archives. I'm guessing main breach, but we'll see. The way they're spawning there. I always shoot your default cameras. I say it every time, but I'll keep saying it for you. Knowledge is everything in Siege. Check for your spawn peaks. Easy little one tap on that camera too. You get that angle perfectly, you don't have to shoot the door or anything. What is that? The drone's floating, but okay. I see how my team needs the grenades to get this off. They have ADSs too. Someone needs to break the door. Guess the ace is gonna go for it, okay. Well, looks like it worked. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go lurk in the back now. Kinda do what I told you guys about. I'm gonna open this for more ghost pressure. In case somebody's down there, they'll have to worry about that now too. To that default, nobody even got that. Nice opener. Okay, Ace. They planted too. Okay, I'm just gonna try to hurry and get in here. That was a quick plant. I'm gonna see on a drone what I can do. Nice. I don't want them to defuse or anything. I heard that Jaeger next to me the whole time, but he couldn't push or anything because teammate on the window. So I was just waiting for that bandit to come back. I heard him and seeing him down our teammate. Down middle. It's all about your surroundings there. I knew it was a 4v2 
and I knew exactly where the last two were. I could hear him and see him. You just got to play off your teammates in those situations. I did not expect to play that fast. That was, what, 30 seconds? I'm down for it, though, if I can have a team like that. We are in champion ELO, of course, even on this account. We have been for a bit. I'm getting close to Emerald on here. I'm still getting over 60 a game for winning. We're losing 10 or 11. Very good situation to already be an Emerald. I think this might be my Plat 1 game. I'm not sure. We'll see afterwards. Very good start. This team I have looks explosive. They went back upstairs, I'd imagine. Mm, this time I might swap to the Abanda so I can do what I was telling you guys. I won't even have time, though, if my team does that again. Taking the Legion to slow us down makes sense. Always preserve your drones, too. Don't just drive them in the bomb site. Usually your teammates are going to do that, so just get on your teammates' drone so you can see everything. Ten seconds before insertion. Five seconds. Hopefully they can get this breach open. So I don't have the nades to help them anymore, and nobody has them. But I'm going to go around and try to do the same thing, but open the wall this time. As I'd imagine, we're going to be more methodical. Oh, nice. Look at that. Ace actually did that. Yeah, they might not even have anything on the wall. I'll just go now. Save my time. And do the same thing here. I'll be shooting the defaults again there. Doesn't matter, I guess. Bravo's gonna kill everybody with the default cam up. I like how she's going there, though. Helps me out. This might be really easy if they're not peeking this. You have dropped the diffuser. Oh, I wish you tried running out of there, that would have been a freebie for me. My device is just rotated to the balcony. I'll have to watch out for the cap cans. Still have half the round, plenty of time. I think he left, so I maybe can go for the wall. Well, got one stuck. Should've just broke that down. It's okay though, I did make a line- oh, there he is. I did make a line of sight. Nice, we have numbers. I'm gonna try to push on my team. Friendly last operator standing. play that well they were not peeking also was there a cap game there i looked and everything i must have just missed seen so that sucks i lost all my health and they knew exactly where i was huge audio cue for them i don't think i had shot or anything before it's okay though that site's a little bit tougher team kind of just died we had a 3v2 those two guys died on me
All I had to do was plant default over there. One guy had to cover. We've kind of just been split up, though. That's the problem. Me and Barov are pushing one side. They're pushing the other. So if they all just die, then kind of in a bad situation. We don't have Diffuser. And they said nobody else to cover them over there. Get some quick information. Oh, I was going to try to get my drone out there, but that didn't work. Obviously, three of my teammates are together, which is nice. Always good to have that coordination. Of course, the game gives me the diffuser. I'm not opposed to that on this site, though. I do like planting here more. It's easier just to get in since it's right here. And I'm usually chilling around this door in the window. It's a good place to use my Twitch drones. That's why I took Twitch. We have the Twitch Bravo combo, too. Which has claymores as well, so I don't have to worry about my jump out. Interesting claymore in the drone hole, but I like it. I like the passion. There goes my Twitch drone. At least to destroy the gadgets too, so whatever. Good trade. So our team already has top control somehow means there's like no holes or anything on the side. I might be able to plant very quick. I'm gonna get one last look here. I'm gonna shoot the front door down too just for more pressure. So nobody can play in that hallway. Do not do what this team is doing. They have nothing on the side. We can just run in. That's what Bravo's doing too. Nice. I'm getting out. Now the claymore to help. I'm just gonna keep a drone on. I planted there because they have to go in sight of the window just to defuse. Unless they put a hole in the wall. So I'm just gonna burn time. Play that situation so good. That was a fun round. All you gotta do is take advantage of where their site's lacking. Just find that hole, find that weakness, and go for it. Me and Bravo had the same idea at the same time too. That was great. I was thinking I was gonna do it too. I was just making sure everything's clear. Better to be more careful. You can be fast, but also not rush yourself at the same time. It's crazy. Earlier I was playing a game and someone was saying I was playing scared. Actually insane. Because my whole team just rushed in and died. And I'm in a 1v2 on attack. And I'm right next to the bomb site. And the round was only like one and a half, maybe less minutes in. I think we were like 110 in and they're just all dead and saying I'm playing scared. And there was a pulse below too. So I didn't want to rush in and get C4. It was crazy. Secure the bombs. People are so dumb. If you have a toxic random message to you, just ignore it or tell them what's up. Sometimes it's not even worth arguing, though, even if you know you're right. There's not much of an argument when they just call you names and whatever. But anyways, where is this drone? Come on, Solus. Probably left now. Ten seconds left. 
These cap cans here are really good. They kind of blend into the wall, like the surface right there. Very, very good. You seen how hard it was for me to see the ones I hit earlier, so just imagine. Or the one. Again, I'm the best cap can player. You always want to do two sets of two and then one set of one somewhere. Okay, I'm going to get out of there. Just wanted to see if they would uh, peek me there. They droned. Shot a drone fall back. Nothing wrong with that. Your main goal is a roamer a lot of the time, just to waste time. The kill is great, but... Is this guy coming in here? He might just be bucking it from outside, underneath. Ooh. I'm just getting back up. They're not really pushing this side at all. Let's see if I can check cameras here. Good rack corner to sit, and I have an L of mine. What are they pushing? They have 4v5 too. It must just all be on the balcony. It's working, I guess. I don't like this L of mine being here. I'm too close. Hopefully one tries to push me here and I can get the kill and then go back. That's probably the cap gains in there. Nice souls to stay alive with me. Okay, I don't think they're pushing this. I'm gonna go back to site two. How am I alive? I knew I had those cap to protect me. I'm not gonna shoot that zero camera, I'm gonna try to bait him here. I knew he's gonna walk up and I'm gonna off angle. He would never expect me doing this. That was clean. Straight for right into cover. I'm kind of destroying these guys. I told you I was a border player. And a cap cam player too. I don't know what that zero was doing too in the coverage. That was so bad. He just let me run through and kill the planter. <laughs> that was crazy. Even with the zero cams, there were two of them. I seen the one on the right side of the wall, so I didn't even bother shooting the left one that was on the inside. Because... They were going to see me anyway, and they were yellow pinging the shit out of me, I'm sure. But it worked, because it got the Nomad to run through my cap gun traps on metal as I was killing the ace. I almost killed the zero at the same time, too. That would have been a real clean 3k. Back to back to back. I know he was nervous, though, in this situation, in the 1v1. They really go with cap gun's gun all the time, too. I don't know what it is. This reflex B, whatever side it is. Russian reflex. I always put these cap cans here. They never expect it to be like on site like that. People run through it all the time, I'm telling you. I'm just gonna reinforce all these walls too and bunker up. Oh, I thought it was down there. Should have prone faster. Nice, got the hatch. Always reinforce this inner wall. At least one of these, whichever side you make the rotate. Reinforce the other side. 
These are my favorite cap cans. They always hit these. Oh, we shoot the stupid speaker. This is a good one too. Sometimes they fall for that. That doesn't look like a doorway. I think I'm just gonna chill in sight. I don't know if it's a good idea because we have two guys in sight already. I don't want to mess with the cab and the solace too much though. So we already have two roamers upstairs. And I have no lines of sight usually that go into bathroom. Or not bathroom tellers. The solus reinforced that wall I noticed. So I can't really hold from here. They're not pushing vents anyway. Vents in workshop. Droning square. Does everyone else call that square? What do people call that like lobby or main lobby or whatever? Nice Valkyrie cams. I wish I had a C4. I have impacts on... Oh, team kill. I have impacts unfortunately. Sludgy and vertical. Sometimes I take C4 but usually I take impacts for rotates. I should not have here. I wasn't even thinking about that. So we already had the castle for that. Impacts are really good against Osa too. That's probably my trap on the yellow ping over there. Osa just set that shield up. If she starts standing on it, I'm going to try to impact her. My team is just all dying. Our run was really bad in this. I wish I could get out of sight right now. I wish I didn't reinforce. Yeah, I was in such a bad spot. There's not really much I could have done. I was kind of stuck in the box. All I could have done was run through the hallway. And that's a suicide. They could have been in so many different areas. Really wish uh, the Solus didn't reinforce over the connector wall between workshop and the hallway. We could have extended that. I could have impacted into workshop. It's okay. Bathroom and tellers, you definitely need a better setup than like what you usually would in Vince. Vince is a little bit easier to play. That's on me for reinforcing that too, but I only did because we didn't have the long angle, so there wasn't much of a point in being in there. It would have been nice to flank though. I think I should have just run from the start because my teammates didn't really do much. It's hard to do anything about those rounds, though. It's just a solo queue round. You can't blame it on yourself. Let's just get this one here. Secure the bombs. The site's been around the meta for a long time, so usually people know how to play it better. Fuck, man, I miss that drone. I'm still gonna do it anyway, I don't care. Okay, maybe I do care. There's like 50 drones around here. And I'm missing all my shots. They're just catching me off guard. Why do they keep peeking me? They've lost three drones now. And then another one spam spotting me. I don't understand. I think our team's actually extending in the bathroom. That's good. So I guess I probably should have taken C4 again. It's on me. I just shot that glass. I just shot the window like there was glass. My habits are too good. It is weird though how some maps have glass and some don't. Very strange. Like I said last round, we didn't have much of a roam. I'm going to try to get on the roam and get vertical. 
Solus is two. I think I'm gonna make a run. Hope they're not already in here with a sledge or something. I think they're hitting sight hard. Let's go team. Good shut down. Still the ying up. I'm gonna try to make another hole. Watch out, Solus. I destroyed the yokai, my bad. They haven't even broken this castle, okay, so we're pretty good here. They're not going for top control at all, which is not a good thing to do. Because defenders can just make holes and watch everything. Let's go, team. I'm not going to throw here. I'm just going to chill above. My team's holding down the other side, so we should be good. Nice, let's go. Well, there's how to play border and solo here. Pretty much a perfect game for me. Interesting aim. Gets the job done. Okay, the SLG squad wasn't too bad. Good supporting team. I actually felt like I had space and room to operate there with a team like that. I like it. Wow, that was a four stack we were playing? That's crazy. Rank 2.0, by the way. I'm in champ MMR. Ooh, we're right on plat 2. It was plat 2, I guess. Not plat 1 for this one. Super close to Emerald, though. Okay, before I end this video off, I'll show you guys the advanced stats. Just to update you on that. And at this point, there's not much time in the season left. Oh, Alpha Pack 2, let's see what I get. Not only a rare, of course. Terrible skin on Glass. I totally play Glass all the time. But there's not much time left in the season. Like I said, I'm going to try to grind through Emerald and Diamond over these next few days and nights. I'm playing a bit more on this account now. Next season, I'll definitely play a lot more on this one. I only started playing, like, recently. I was only playing a few games a week, pretty much, for the first couple months of the season. We're also very close to another operator, so next video we'll probably get that. Here's the advanced stats for you guys. We've played 40 matches now, 1.7 KD, if you care about that. 65% win rate, which is very, very good for solo queuing. I will take that any day. Only a couple games off, maybe three off Emerald now. So hopefully by the next video I'll have that, but we'll see. If you did enjoy though, leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.